Hey, this is Abe with Shift. Today we're gonna to be talking about understanding the indicator lights on your moonwalkers. So we've got a couple different lights. Everything's communicated through them in terms of your operational state. So when you first turn them on, you'll see the breathing white light and then they'll go solid white light when they're, everything's connected. So that's how you know you're ready to go and the shoe's also in lock mode. So that's where our brake is engaged. Shoes aren't moving anywhere. So that is the solid white light. Then when you go into run mode, it's gonna be a solid green light. So that's the solid green light here. That's how you know you're in moonwalking mode. So this is where you walk at the speed of a run. Another mode that we have is gonna be our pre-safe mode. So this is when you have a breathing amber light. So that is right before your moonwalkers are gonna go into the safe mode, which is a great speed reduction. So that's either when you're at a, a lower battery or a higher internal temperature. Uh, we're gonna start to slow you down. So this is your warning phase right before you move into that slow. So if you look down and you see this as a breathing amber light, you know you got a couple minutes left until you go into the reduced speed mode. So a solid amber light is gonna be in safety mode. So this is the mode you reach when you're near the end of your battery life or when your internal temperature has heated up. So we have to reduce your speed. So this is slightly faster than normal walking. It's basically built so that you can reach your final destination or get to a place where you feel comfortable taking your moonwalkers off until you can get them back on, onto the charge. So if your moonwalkers are doing a flashing red light, that means you have a fault code. So you've entered a hard fault. So if you have a hard fault, it's gonna be a flashing red. It's depending on the number of flashes is gonna indicate what fault you have. And for that, you're just gonna check our website uh, to see what the updated fault codes are.